Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Java interview questions. That is, is Java a 100% object-oriented programming language? The answer is no. Java is not a 100% object-oriented programming language. If you would have asked me, is Java a object-oriented programming language? My answer will be yes. Java is a object-oriented programming language, but not 100%. That's why the answer is no. As a question here is being asked, like, is Java a 100%? Because of which the answer is no, guys. It's not 100%. It's object-oriented, but not 100%. Why Java is not a 100% object-oriented programming language? Because of this concept known as primitive data types. In Java, we have some primitive data types like uh, byte, Okay, short, int, long, float, double, char, boolean. All these primitive data types in Java are not object-oriented type. Okay, so they don't deal with the objects, guys. Okay, they, you see why these are non, not object-oriented in Java? Because in the olden days, when the developers have developed Java, Okay, at that time, the machines were not having so much of memory. So these byte, short, int, long, float, double, care, boolean, primitive data types used to be used like anything by developers. Okay, developers used to use all these uh, data types, primitive data types for storing the values into these particular variables and all. Okay, a lot of statements uh, used to contain all these primitive data types. So they thought like the developers at that time thought that, okay, if you make this particular primitive data types object oriented, it will consume a lot of memory. Okay, that much memory is not available at that time. So they decided to put this primitive data types as non object oriented so that they can consume less memory. Okay, byte will consume only one byte, short will consume two bytes, int will consume four bytes, long will consume double the size that is eight bytes, and so on. Okay, that kind of size they can consume, but if object oriented, they would have been consumed more memory because of which Java developers, okay, while developing this uh, primitive data types, thought of making them non-object oriented. Remaining portion of Java is object oriented, okay? But later what happened over a period of time, things changed and nowadays, you know, we have a lot of memory, okay, in our computer machines and all, we got a lot of memory, but uh, Java guys still felt like why to? Why to unnecessarily make them object oriented and consume a lot of memory still. Okay. Even though these days it, it is okay for a programming language uh, to have these data types also as object oriented uh, because memory is fully available, but still Java developers thought that there's no use in making this object oriented because they're already saving the memory. So now also they will save the memory. So what's the matter? They kept it like that only. Hence, Java is not a 100% object-oriented case, except primitive, primitive data types. Everything in Java is object-oriented, okay? Except primitive data, primitive data types. That's why the answer is no, okay? So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.